Perfectly Hidden Depression by Margaret Robertson Rutherford, PhD. So how to break free from the perfectionism that make, that masks your depression. So part one, understanding perfectly hidden depression. Part two, the five stages of healing. Part three, living your true self. And it's, yeah, not part one, part two, but like the same kind of page count. Um, resources and references at the end. Um, so who it's written for. Um, I'm, I'm sad to say that there is no age range, no gender, no race or religion that is immune to perfectionism and PhD. If the term perfectly hidden depression intrigues you, if you felt immediate relief, connection or curiosity when you saw the title of this book, if your perfectionism is becoming far too burdensome, then this book is for you. Um, And then it goes into different types of people. Um, if you're struggling with suicidal thoughts or those thoughts emerge when you're, you're doing this work, you need to seek immediate professional treatment. If you're younger, blah, if you're a parent, da 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 da. Um, and then it tells what um, perfectly hidden depression is. And then um, it goes into like different reflections. So like things you, um, the reader could be doing. Um, to me, I don't think um, you need to do every single one of them, but you do get um, information and then um, the reflections kind of are in between the information and then it's kind of like reflection this reflection 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 <laughs> so um and you are getting some people's stories in this as well and So, and like you progress the information, you progress through the information presented in the information. Um, you got two pages of resources. So like um, some books and then references that the author has used um, for the book. So I do think it can um, be helpful if you're wanting to really work through um, like the, um, the depression, anxiety, um, whatever kind of grouping that brought you to reading the book or if it does seem like of interest to you um i do think it can be it can be helpful um but it all depends on if you're wanting to do st stuff like this because like some of it is like journaling writing it and some people aren't wanting to do that or aren't ready to do that which is per perfectly fine because like some people are, are like will eventually get to the writing and it can be helpful um, but yeah, and I think it can be helpful. I'm gonna stop before I say that line anymore. But yeah, perfectly hidden depression. Happy readings.